investigated in the flyer trial um, the randomized comparison of six cycles are chop versus four cycles are chop um, in young pa patients with favorable prognosis of diffuse large speed cell lymphoma because from the MINT trial we know that there is a patient population with an excellent prognosis those patients present with age adjusted IPI of zero they are between 18 and 60 years old they have limited stage disease and no bulky disease meaning that their maximum tumor diameter is less than 7.5 centimeters their uh, three-year progression free survival in the MINT trial was 95 percent therefore we intended to investigate whether um, we could maintain efficacy and reduce toxicity by reduction of top cycles it is safe to give only four cycles of our chop plus two cycles um, rituximab. It was a non-inferiority st uh, study, so we pr uh, showed that with respect to progression-free survival, event-free survival and overall survival, um, four cycles of our chop are non-inferior to um, the previous standard uh, six cycles of our chop. We could also reduce toxicity by about a third, both in hematological toxicity with respect to lycocytopenia and anemia, and uh, in non-hematological toxicity. Uh, this was also reduced by one third. Improvement is really difficult in this patient population. We, but there are some patients that if they have a pet positive if they are pet positive after four cycles it would be interesting to investigate whether um, after this uh, additional two cycles of rituximab and CHOP they would profit from radiotherapy